And we have a tech company called 52 Productions. Yeah. And what we're doing is we're taking all games. And I have a number, number of games that I created starting at 11 years old at the School of the Visually Impaired. That one, the first one that's coming out, we call Bad B-A-T-T-Y. Betty, yes, your first. Anyway, so we're taking, yeah, and we're adding voice into it. In other words, if you can't see, you don't have any hands, you can play. So uh, for me, ever since the the rest of my vision went south and I can no longer put a card up like this and try to get to figure out what they were, I, I can't play cards anymore. But with Adam's technology, and just so you know, he's called the father of voice AI. He's the one that first created the concept of talking to your devices. And I remember uh, Adam from Fulas also. He did a yes. great, great yes. trick in Fulas. Yes, he did a, a Fulas thing. And he and I both had landed with the Magic Castle this this year. And that was always a dream of his. He has, he has filled the dream of many people. And I was fortunate that I was able to fill a dream for him, and that was get him a uh, run, uh, working run for Magic Castle. And the thing is, what he did at the castle, I can't tell you guys, but the effect that he did is not nearly as impressive as how he did it. And uh, I'll just, I'll, I'll do, okay, when Adam's going to see this, I'll just say AI. <laughs> and, you know, that made me think, you're Georgian. And one of our the persons invested in our company is somebody everyone out there should know, Zaza Pachulia. Zaza, the basketball player, really? they won two MVP uh, champions, championships uh, with the Golden State Warriors, I believe it was. And that was, I think, 2017, 2018. Anyway, many of your listeners should know who Zaza Pachulia is. And yes, he's uh, yes. of course. one of the participants yeah. in our company. We Georgians are very proud of Zaza. Yes, just like uh, we have, you know, people that we're proud of, and and you have uh, the people over there that you're proud of, and I'm sure that he's right at the top of the list because he's gone so far and done so much, and not many people can say they were champions. Well, that's uh, that was a very great news for me. Uh, and uh, uh, when you talked about Adam, I think the fundamentals of magic are very important uh, in every profession. Yeah, and that is a good point, uh, AJ, is there are so many people that magic was the beginning of what they did. I'll, I'll use a word, the impetus, the starting point. Adam was a magician as a kid. He wanted to be a magician when he grew up. Instead of becoming a magician, he became a tech magician. He used the same principles he learned as a kid in magic to design and create Siri and all these other things that have literally changed the world. I'll just, I'm going to get off on a little tangent. We, uh, we have a friend named Dave McFatsian. He was a big TV and Hollywood producer. He did a TV series called Home Improvement with Tim Allen and movies like What Women Want, Mel Gibson and others. But we've been friends since the 1970s. And the three of us were together. And I always say, you know, I, they say I inspired the world. David entertained the world, but Adam changed the world. His technology has changed the world.